Hey, how you doing? This is uh, the Financial Survivalist out in the Absaroka Beartooth Wilderness in the middle of the Galatian National Forest. Um, I decided to take this time to do a quick review of the North Face Tadpole 23 tent. We've actually been pounded by some thunderstorms for three-ish hours. <laughs> and so um, it's definitely getting tested. As you can see, um, there's water on top but it's pretty dry. I mean, with a lot of tents I've had in the past, if you like touch it, huh? the water will come through, do but it. <laughs> it just runs off the side. So it's waterproof. It's got the bathtub bottom and it's perfectly dry down here, which is good. You can see the water through there. Plenty of ventilation on the side and plenty of room. Plus there's these little ties you see right there that you can, like we tied a clothesline to it through the, there's a bunch of them all around the sides and we tied a clothesline to dry up some of our, dry some of our clothing from earlier in the day. It was pretty hot, got in the, uh, I don't know, high 70s, but we were hiking with 30 pound packs, so um, we broke a sweat and some of our clothing got a little sweaty, so we decided to hang it up and let it dry. But um, the tadpole, something else I really like about it, is the vestibule. Our uh, backpacks are in this space back here, staying nice and dry, which is nice. And then also, if you want, you can open the zipper at the top, and it's got a fairly thick overlap, which will allow for um, ventilation. So you can vent out the top if it's getting too hot. A lot of tents don't have um, ventilation towards the top, and that's ventilation you can open and close. But, um, so all in all, it's a good tent. We uh, spent a couple hundred dollars on it. I'll link it up, but it's a really good, I think it's a really good purchase. It's kept us really dry. Hopefully this rain will stop so we can get out and do some fishing, maybe cook some dinner. Build a fire. Um, build a fire. Yeah, there's no fire restrictions up here right now, which is really nice. But uh, that's it. It's Financial Ben checking out.